creating a repository done adding an existing repository done now comes drag and drop option now to use this i'm going to make a new directory or sorry a new folder i'm going to name this as demo drag since this is the drag and drop demo inside this i'm going to copy the readme and dot git ignore file and now let me head over to desktop and it says you can drag and drop the file so i'm going to try it so let me drag demo drag here i'm dragging okay now it says you can make a repository here i'm sure initialize with readme sure no git no no license it's done it says publish repository or open in vs code now this is demo drag since inside readme it is demo drag i'm going to edit it this is the drag and drop demo okay fine save it and now if i head to desktop i say this has been changed now let me commit it drag and drop commit to master and now publishing the repository i don't want a description or i can have it just like the name publish repository okay it's now pushing to the origin and once it's done you will be able to see a demo drag repository in my github account so it says view on github now here it is the demo drag repository on my github account the commit says drag and drop and the readme says this is drag and drop demo okay this is from the vs code okay now let me close it we are done with the drag and drop this is as simple as it looks like and we are done with drag and drop demo so let me remove the repository i'm going to remove it yes to the bin remove and it's been removed and we are done with all the three options of creating the repository and now it comes cloning the repository now we have to clone the repository from github account clone mohammed akil slash blockchain this is my blockchain repository from the github inside of these i have cloned mohammed akif slash blockchain it is showing me the url or github.com i can directly paste the url here and i will select blockchain to clone i'm going to clone so hit the clone button or i can do from url pasting the url of the repository from the github i'll do it later but for now i'll go for blockchain i'm going to clone it it says cloning blockchain now the blockchain repository from my github account has been cloned and let me open it now this is the blockchain to make sure this is the blockchain and inside blockchain i have source and all the three files that are on my github account so this is how you clone from your github account and i'm going to clone a repository not from here but from the url so i go to url and i'll paste the url of the repository i want to clone so i go to github and let me search some repository to clone let me be tech store must be fine should be fine and i'll go to clone now you have four options using the https using the download zip that old traditional way of downloading the zip and then extracting it and then using the content or you can open in the desktop just like i'm doing it right now you can use the https means the url of this and the clone with ssh now ssh is something that I'll, i will introduce and i will make a video after this 
the cloning with SSH is highly secure. So for now I will go for HTTPS. I have copied the URL of this repo, React Text Store. So inside desktop I am going to paste the URL of React Text Store. So I am going to clone it. It's, it says cloning React Text Store. Okay. Now my text store has been cloned. Now I'm going to open it. So this is React Text Store from my GitHub account, which has been cloned. And this is how you can clone in two ways, either from the URL or directly from the desktop option. So this is my full React Text Store. So I'm going to update it. So let me add a comment from cloning the repo. Sorry. REPO it should be REPO okay from cloning the repo I have added a comment and it says source app.js has been compromised or updated okay I'm going to add a commit app.js is updated commit to master and I'm going to push the origin either from there or from here so I'm going to push it is pushing to the origin okay hold on and now if I go to react text store and refresh you will see a commit that app.js clone updated okay this is source inside source it must be from app.js yes inside app.js it is app.js clone updated so this is how you can update the clone and it will show that I have added the comment okay this is how you can clone an existing file from your uh, existing repo sorry from your github account this is all about how you can use the github desktop to update or to clone or to uh, push your repositories to your github account I have told you three ways of pushing the repositories to your github account and two ways of cloning from your github account so this was all about the GitHub desktop. If you find this video useful and you learned something from this video, then please give a like. And if you are stuck at any, any point, then please mention it in the comment section. I'll be happy to resolve it. Till then, thank you and goodbye.